Hey guys, this is Jay. Today we are going to see how to create Oscar gold text effect in Photoshop. Before getting started, please do download the project file, link in the description. With the project file, it will be much easier for you to follow this tutorial. So download the project file and get ready. In case if you want that completely designed .psd file and the layer style means, hit the like button soon after reaching 100 likes, I'll give you the download link. Fine, let's get started. First go to the project file, open the psd file inside Photoshop. This one is a design ready file. I have given you the color palette, the colors we are going to use in this design. If you want, you can create your own canvas. Fine. Next, we are going to create a solid color background for that create a layer. Go to color picker, sample and select black color. Now fill the color. I used the keyboard shortcut alt backspace. Next, we are going to type in our text for that select the text group, create layer, go to color picker, sample and select white color. Now pick the text tool. The font I'm using is a free font, I'll give link in the description. I'll keep size as 245 points and I'll type in my text. Fine, I'll place it at the center here. Next, we're going to add our gold effect. For that, right click the layer, go to blending option, select gradient overlay. There, I'm going to keep the blending mode as normal, opacity as underwrap. Now, click the gradient bar, select the first gradient option on the left side. I'm going to choose new color, sample and select this bright yellow color from the color palette. Click OK. Next on right side, I'm going to change the color. I'm going with this kind of faded yellow color, this one. Click OK. Now I'm going to change the style to reflected. I'll keep the angle as 90, scale as 100. Fine. Next, enable bevel and emboss. There, I'll keep the style as inner bevel, technique as chisel art. In shading, I'm going to keep the angle as 120, I'll keep the angle as 30. In the glass contour option, I'm going to select double ring option, this one. Next, I'll enable the anti alias option. Fine. Next, in the highlight mode, I'll keep the opacity as 75%. And in the shadow mode, I'll keep the opacity as 75. Now we will get such kind of stroke kind of effect. Next, I'm going to fill the effect completely. For that, I'm going to increase the size to something around 45. There you go. Next, I'm going to increase the depth. I'm going with 170 here. Fine. Next, we're going to add inner shadow. I'll keep the blending mode as multiply. Next, I'll keep the opacity as 50. I'm not going to add noise. In the color option, I'm going to sample and select this orange color. And in elements, I'm going to keep the size as 70. Now I'm not going to disturb other settings. Now click OK. There you go, we got our gold text effect. Next, I'm going to create a duplicate copy of this text layer by using keyboard shortcut Ctrl J. I'll move the text above. Now I'll change the size to 75 points. I'll edit the text. I'll place it at the center. Fine. Next, we're going to add line shape. For that, go to the design group, create a layer. Now go to color picker, sample and select white color. Now pick the line tool. Make sure fill is enabled, the stroke is disabled. I'll keep the weight as 5 pixels. Now by holding shift key, create a perfect line shape like so. Now we're going to add same gold effect to this line shape. For that, go to the text group, select any layer, text layer, right click and copy the layer style. Now select the line shape layer, right click, paste the layer style. There you go. Now I'll create a duplicate copy using keyboard shortcut Ctrl J. Move it to right side. Adjust the spacings using your keyboard arrow keys. 
once you're done next we're going to create another line at the bottom here for that create a layer pick the line tool with same settings i'm going to create another line shape by holding shift key in your keyboard now adjust the spacings using your keyboard arrow keys next we're going to repeat the same step right click paste the layer style fine now we are almost done next we're going to drop in our stock image before that i'll disable the color palette i'll move the text and line shape to right side a little bit fine next we're going to drop in our oscar statue stock image for that go to the project file open the image inside photoshop drag and drop the image inside our canvas i'll place it inside image group now enable free transform tool control t and resize it i'll place it on left side here fine next we are going to drop in another stock image for that go to the project file open the bokeh stock image inside photoshop now drag and drop the image inside our canvas make sure to place it inside effects folder this one now enable free transform tool right click and rotate it 90 degree counter clockwise now reduce the size a little bit i'll place it on left side here fine now change the layer blending mode to screen as a final step we're going to add a, another effect for the create a layer inside effects 2 folder i'll change the blending mode to screen now enable the color palette now go to color picker sample and select this orange color click okay now pick the brush tool select soft round brush this one i'll keep the flow as 40% Now I'll give give a single click at the bottom here. Another one here. Another one on top here. There you go. Now our Oscar gold text effect is ready. So that's it guys. I hope this video is useful to you. Don't forget to hit the like button for more tutorials. Subscribe to my channel and please do check out my other videos. Thanks for watching. Take care.